Now a CBS4 exclusive, Barbara Streisand is one of the best-selling music artists of all time with a total of 145 million records sold, sold worldwide. She has a new album out, which will be released at the end of this month. Last night, Streisand kicked off her North American concert tour in Los Angeles. The night before, she held a special rehearsal for friends and family only. CBS4's Lisa Petrillo was there and has this exclusive behind-the-scenes look. I just want more, ask what I want. As the only artist to achieve number one albums in each of six decades, Barbara Streisand's brand new concert tour called The Music, The Memories, The Magic is truly all about the memories. tour, which officially opened Tuesday night at the Staples Center in Los Angeles, through a friends and family rehearsal show the night before, which is when we were invited by the show's co-director, Miami's own Richard J. Alexander. CBS4 first introduced you to him last year when he showed us around his Broadway-inspired Miami Beach home. It's filled with many of the big shows he's worked on, including countless pictures with his favorite star, Barbara Streisand. Yeah, that's one of my favorite pictures from Back to Brooklyn, and that's walking Barbara either from the stage or to the stage. I've been working with Barbara for 16 years now, but this is unlike anything we've ever done, so tonight's the first audience ever that's going to see this. For this production, which includes duets with special guests such as Babyface, Seth MacFarlane, and Jamie Foxx, and heartfelt tributes to her songs from those unforgettable films, Richard J. says audiences will reminisce and be awed. Woo! I've been here for 12 weeks working with Barbara and with our team, and uh, it's going to be a pretty spectacular show. We're celebrating six decades of number one albums. It's a remarkable career unlike anybody. It's been a busy year for the star who's been in talks about starring in the remake of Gypsy. Last November, she received the Medal of Honor at the White House along with other notables, including Miami's own Gloria Stefan and her friend Steven Spielberg. We were there as well. He's only slightly my older sister. Just slightly. <laughs> only slightly. Yeah. I want a and at age 74, it's clear Streisand's instrument is stronger than ever. Does she blow your mind every time you hear her sing after all these years? Every single day. It's pretty remarkable. If I never worked another day in my life, uh, she would be it. Of everybody I've worked with, she's it. And you're here, and I'm so excited. The tour ends at the end of the month, but for Barbara Streisand, the music, the memories, and the magic lives on, celebrating six decades of number one hits. At the Staples Center, I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News.